everybody. Um, I got something new and exciting and different for me. Um, it's a Clarisonic. I have been having a few bit of issues with <clears throat> my skin. I'm not sure it's because I'm getting older, if it's because I'm starting to wear makeup more. Still haven't dabbled into the foundation. Um, I'm mostly a powder girl, and that's really all I need is powder. Um, the foundation is like too much for me, and shading this in, and contouring your nose, and I, I'm gonna just leave my nose how it is, and not contour anything, just one color. That's me, I just wanna be one color. <laughs> so, um, the Clarisonic just came in today. So I will be doing a review on this. I was told that it's a possibility that you could break out like the first week since everything is being uh, pretty much released from your pores and brought to the surface and to not give up and push through it. It should last about a week or so. I'm hoping that I'm not getting uh, any of that. Um, <laughs> I'm not sorry for that. Um, but the kind I got is the Mia 2. Um, it's because it has two speeds. This is what it looks like in the box, or plastic. So yeah. Um, I've been wanting to try this out. They told me that I should push, turn, and it pops right out. It's pretty cool, okay? And then, for the hard to reach spaces like your eyebrows, in between your brows, your nose, these nose, I have like dry skin. Dry um, skin. And this little part pops out. So it popped out. <laughs> and then you put it on the thingy like that, make sure it's snapped. And then Yeah. You get the drift. And then you take it off. And you take it off. That was simple. And you put it back in through the big way. Okay, so I know um, most people do it after they do a review, but I'm a research like fanatic. I'm not perfect, so I don't do it every single time. Um, but I try to make sure that whatever I'm purchasing, I figure out how to use it prior to, and then when I get it, figure out how to use it preferably for me. Um, so here are some of the notes that I took um, prior to buying this. So I, because I didn't want to, I wanted to minimize the issues of, um, saying it doesn't work, or this happened, or that happened. I tried to YouTube a lot to figure out uh, the product before I bought it. Found out that this is not an exfoliator. Um, it does not exfoliate, it cleans, it's a cleaner. Um, and it, it's not so much deep pore cleansing, um, but it cleans your pores deeper than, say like your rag, or your hands, or your fingernails. It really gets in with the brushes. And I think it's like 300 turns per second or something like that. So it's pretty fast, um, but this brush is very gentle. So I'm gonna try this brush. I do have two more brushes coming in. Um, and we'll see how those brushes work. So you kind of trial air with the brushes, but I was told not to get the deep pore cleansing brushes because they said it's really harsh and a lot of people that I've seen on YouTube just didn't like them. I was told, or 
I found out that you should not use this with an exfoliant because you have this going on and then you have the things with the crystals in it or the bees or sugar or salt in it. So you're just like double tearing up your skin can have a lot of cuts and everything. So they said don't use it with an exfoliator, use either or. Um, I'm not quite sure if you use a full exfoliator first and then use your soap and do this. I'm not sure it's gonna be trial and error for me. Um, but I definitely was, was looking at that when they said don't use it with an exfoliator and when they explained it, it's really cool. Do not use an oil-based product with this um, item because the bristles um, um, hold the oil and it's very, very hard to get the oil out of your, your brushes. Um, and then these brushes are supposed to last like a month. Um, but if you use oil-based products, you might have to use them buy them every month. And these are like $25 for one or 44 a pair. So, can you get expense? Um, I got mine off of Amazon.com and it was like $150. Um, but I had gift cards, so, you know, thank you to all my friends. Do not use alcohol-based products with this item, with these brushes, because it's very drying. And then it kind of kind of like split the hairs in half or whatever as it dries. And then again, the $25 or 40 bucks of hair, expensive. Okay, so here is the cadence at which it's supposed to go at according to what I researched. So don't mark me, okay? I haven't even used it yet. So I tell you what I researched. So this thing beeps two times, 20 seconds, two times, 10 seconds, then you're supposed to be done with your entire face. It's like this. 20 seconds on your nose and chin. Beep! 20 seconds on your forehead and brown line. Ten seconds on each cheek. Beep. All done, and then you you can put it away. This product can be used twice a day. I'm very busy. People who know me personally know I'm busy, so I'll probably just do it in the evening, and then um, I can give you a proper review. But I just wanted to give you a little bit of tip, the information that I found out um, because I researched so freaking much um, products before I buy them. Um, and I'll be back with my Glarisonic. 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 I remember that song. It's super sonic. Super sonic. Okay, bye-bye.